And then, you know, I mean, I'm just saying, there's no privacy, so go ahead and turn on the lens, let it all be, but, you know. To tell me first, your home was devalued. Devalued. Prior yeah. to 2005, artificially. Correct. That's correct. And... Because I don't fully understand the cycle. I know this is a sensitive issue, but I thought I would record this part. And now we're seeing some people having difficulty affording the property taxes because the property's no, been quickly. It, I, never, it's never ever any delinquency on the property taxes. Mm -hmm. They said we built an uh, right. oversized two-car garage without their permission. And we did not. Uh, that was, was was built in 1908, and the same year the house was built. Now they, we're talking about the city of Portland? Uh, the county of Multnomah. Multnomah County. Wow. They are very criminal on, in a lot of different ways. So, the, okay, kind of elaborate. So they were they were telling you what you couldn't couldn't do on your property. First of all. Well. Uh, you don't have to get into all of it, but they they basically devalued the home because yeah, yeah. they didn't like that you were uh, changing things. And it made it difficult to try and uh, 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 maintain the contract. You said you were building something? Yeah, yeah. Like another, like a shed or something like that? Or In any case, uh -huh. <laughs> um, <clears throat> there are lots of aspects of that, Buddha. <laughs> right. But it did surprise me that they just did an arbitrary devaluation because we, they claimed we did not use permits, ask permits. And, and the fact is that, again, the garage was, a separate garage was built in, in, uh, in 1908, the same year as the house. And uh, the, it had fallen into disrepair. And I called via telephone and say, hey, uh, I, do I need a permit to rebuild a wall and uh, replace the roof on my garage? Mm -hmm. And they said, nope. I said, great, cool, thank you, click. And I replaced the wall and rebuilt the roof. Now when they came around to help us with our uh, taxes, <laughs> which most people were looking for. Right. They claimed that we had built the garage without any permits. They claimed that there was no garage existent. <laughs> and, and rather than giving us a citation or inviting us to court civilly over the matter, they uh, said, so since you did this without permission, I would have uh, we're going to assign this arbitrary value to your property, and uh, and we didn't. We were we weren't able to recover quickly enough to do anything to. Uh, and they, she didn't. Uh, like I say, she didn't write out a citation, which would be the logical course but not to lie on the books about our property. But there you go. I'm sorry, yeah. Multnomah County, right? That's correct. So, so to you, and it was criminal what they did? Just, just to... Uh, uh, like or, you say, uh, within uh, four weeks of losing the house, Something of that nature. Yeah, yeah, I would say it's definitely immoral, an immoral situation. So you lost your house in 2005 because of them calling the legality. Uh, that, that pushed it over the and, edge. Yeah, the permits. Uh, this is a familiar story with a lot of people with with these uh, right. the, measures. They penalized us. They judged us. Right. And they us mm -hmm. with out any process whatsoever because devaluing our property is uh, carrying out a sentence uh, for and uh, they she pronounced a judgment about uh, uh, that our our building illegally on the property 
she accused us, convicted us and sentenced us, and executed this sentence all in a stroke of a pen.